<laughs> the sun went down, Larry Mack came up, and here we are. 24 years of you and me doing this between CBS and cable and, and now Fox. So glad to have you join us for this next hour. So, as you heard on Race Hub, we're in a quandary. If you think you can run for the pole for the Daytona 500, you have one agenda in this final hour. If you think you need to get ready to race for Thursday night, you may have a different agenda because after qualifying, the cars all get parked and put away and you can't hardly touch them until Thursday night. So, driver, Clint Boyer, what do you want to do? Well, I think you nailed it right there. I want to know what I have for a hot ride. I want to go out there, run a single car run, see some speed in this hot ride. If I don't have that, maybe I need to go back out, get in a draft with my teammates, a manufacturer like you heard Bobby Lilani talk about, and see what this thing drives like in a draft. Two different things for this practice right here, Larry. Yeah, if you look at the first practice, I think we saw exactly what we thought we would see. We did see a lot of draft packs. They were very controlled. They were very organized. But I do think we're going to see more of that in this. But I think for the most part, we're going to see these teams see this is the last practice before yeah. qualifying. You want to see, to Clint's point, exactly how fast that car is. And then there's the old Chad Canals theory. If I make it fast by itself, it may be faster in a pack. <laughs> All right.